Good evening. This is Grasshopper. It's a uh, Wednesday, November 29th, 2023. Um, got a story here I wanted to share. Um, a Zen Buddhist story called Pointing at the Moon. So I made a little slideshow here and I'll read you this story. And maybe we'll, maybe we'll learn something together. So the story is called Pointing at the Moon. So one day, a nun named Wu Jing Kang asked the sixth Zen patriarch, Kuan Yang, and she said, I've been studying the Nirvana Sutra for years and years, and there are still some passages that I don't quite understand. And she asked the monk, do you think you could explain them to me? So she gives the um, sutra to um, the monk. And he said, and the monk said, um, or what's his, Quanyang, Quanyang, the monk said, I'm sorry, but I can't read. If you can read the passages out for me, I'll see if I can help you understand them. To this, the uh, nun replied, if you can't even read the words, how can you understand the truth behind them? And Quang the monk replied, "The truth and words are unrelated. The truth can be compared to the moon." Quang continued, "And words can be compared to a finger." And he went on to say, I can use my finger to point out the moon, but my finger is not the moon. If you don't, and if you don't need my finger to see, and you don't need the finger to see the moon, now do you? So in summary, the lesson to be learned here, language is merely a tool for pointing out the truth. A means to help us attain enlightenment. To mistake words for the truth is almost as ridiculous as mistaking a finger for the moon. So, yeah. So anyway, that was that's the story. Um, I'm going to try to make some more videos like this. Hope you enjoyed it.